Hey guys and welcome to the final part of my um, Challenger Sabatron review. This time we have Cyclonus. He's a repaint of Universe Cyclonus, obviously. Um, done in much nicer colours this time. Um, just looks really nice. Um, not quite as good as the Henke, but still very, very cool. I'm going to focus on Nightstick here. He's a little, is it? Yeah, get the word out properly. He's a target master. Um, let's transform into a teen little robot. Um, about the size of a minicon. Well, he's a minicon slash target master. I don't know. He is pretty cool. Um, he's one of the better target masters. He does actually have articulation. I'm going to zoom in so you can actually see the guy properly. Um, he does actually have articulation, believe it or not. Um, so, yeah. You know, he's got a lot of articulation. His arms can rotate 360, he can bend at the elbow. Um, he's got leg articulation. He's actually got a feet pivot, so you can get him into a few little poses, but not many. Um, you can kind of get him to do a little kick, I don't know, um, but I'm just zoom out a second. Having this huge cannon thing on his back actually acts as a better support, but you know, still probably won't work that well, because he is kind of heavy. Um, uh, you know, whatever. Um, still, he's a pretty cool little target master there. Um, so yeah, um, now on to the awesomeness, Cyclonus, um, I was a big fan of Cyclonus from G1, um, you know, probably my favourite episode with him in was um, the Ghost of Starscream, but I don't know why, he just seemed a little bit more badass then, um, I love the red windows on him, it's really cool, and the detail just looks awesome, um, so yeah, anyway, um, for landing gear and let's transform him. So anyway, I want to I want to have that um, fold on the little feet like that and just fold the legs together, tap them together just like that. Tap them together just like that. And there's one thing I want to point out and um, probably can't even see it on this camera. Um, I haven't got it focused properly or somewhere. Um, I'm trying to find the best way to show this off. Oops. Um, I don't know if you can kind of see in there, but there is a little bit of a um, white mark in there on the ball joint. Um, so I'm hoping that that's not anything serious, but yeah, it's just worrying me that it might actually break. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be careful when transforming him. Um, so yeah, anyway, rotate these up. Like that, take this, push it in there, um, just kind of fold the cockpit up there, just like that. Then tab these onto his shoulders, rotate that head around, um, pull out the arms. This one's kind of stiff, don't know why. Um, pull out the hand, pull the fist, sorry. Um, same again, pull out the fist, and fold this onto his back. Like that. I keep dropping him. Um, and there you have Cyclonus in robot mode. Now, the one thing that I want to show off is the head. Um, the paint apps on this head have been done so well. Um, it is a metallic silver. Um, well, it's just, it's not metallic silver, it's just really cool silver. And the light piping looks so unbelievably evil. Um, so, yeah, for a guy with bunny ears, um, he looks very evil. Um, so, yeah. But, he is very awesome. Um, he's got a lot of articulation. Um, and he just looks completely badass. Um, so, yeah, and I love the Decepticon symbol on there. Um, it's really cool. Um, so, yeah. And also, a little um, nightstick here. You can actually... be held as an actual gun in robot mode um, so yeah um, yeah very cool or if you don't want to um, have him holding nightstick you can actually store him um, on Cyclonus's back there and it just kind of sticks up um, just like that but you know very cool I do like this figure um, so yeah probably the highlight of the set um, for me so yeah, anyway, 
and just get them all, get the gang together, even though they are enemies, well, Rodimus is the enemy of Cyclonus and Galvatron, um, so yeah, as a set overall, a very cool set, um, just really awesome, so yeah, anyway, thanks for watching my Challenge of Cybertron 3 pack review, um, so yeah, I decided to redo all three reviews uh, in HD, so yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please subscribe.